Chelsea High School is excited, of course, to welcome our students back on campus. For everyone's safety, there are new procedures in place aimed at helping prevent the spread of COVID-19. We want to put your minds at ease and ensure everyone understands the new procedures and expectations. These videos demonstrate some of the key changes that have been made. For information on this and other changes, go to Biloxi Schools Back to School Plan on our website, www.biloxischools.net. Student arrival on campus remains the same with one addition. Staff members will be on duty to ensure that students are properly masked before getting out of the vehicle and entering the building. Masks must be worn while moving from the vehicle to the entrance. Remember, bus riders must have their mask on starting when they arrive at the bus stop. Also, all students must wear their ID badge visibly at all times. For more information on Biloxi Public Schools Back to School Plan, visit BiloxiSchools.net and click on the Back to School Plan logo. Students wanting breakfast will pick up a grab-and-go breakfast from the cafeteria, then report immediately to their first period class. Social distancing will be maintained when students are picking up a grab-and-go breakfast. Additional staff members will be on duty and physical markings will designate the required six feet of distance between all people. Students not eating breakfast will report directly to their first period class. For more information on Biloxi Public Schools Back to School Plan, visit BiloxiSchools.net and click on the Back to School Plan logo. All students will walk on the right side of the hall at all times. During class changes, students will exit the classroom to the right and stay on the right at all times. Masks will be worn at all times. Students must wear a face mask in transition and while in the restroom. During class changes, staff members will be on duty near restrooms to ensure that restrooms do not become overcrowded. Between each class, desks will be sanitized. High-touch surfaces will be clean and sanitized throughout the day. For more information on Biloxi Schools Back to School Plan, visit BiloxiSchools.net and click on the Back to School Plan logo. All students, faculty, and staff must wear a mask while on campus. Masks should cover the nose and mouth. Students who are not wearing a mask will be asked to comply. Students who do not have a mask or do not comply will be reported to an administrator. When physical distancing can be achieved, masks can be removed only if the classroom teacher specifically gives permission to do so. Student and staff badges should be visibly worn at all times. For more information on Biloxi Schools Back to School Plan, visit BiloxiSchools.net and click on the Back to School Plan logo. The cafeteria will be providing limited options when we get back to school. That includes prepared packaged portions. Self-serve options won't be available. For touchless number entry, students will scan a barcode on their badge. Additional staff members will be on duty and physical markings will designate the required six feet of distance between all people. Seating areas at tables will be physically distanced. Students will be assigned a designated lunch area, which will be indicated on their badge. Only while seated and eating may students remove their masks. Students must put their masks on before getting up from the lunch table. For more information on Biloxi Public Schools Back to School Plan, visit BiloxiSchools.net and click on the Back to School Plan logo. Release times will be staggered. Teachers will release with their students, keeping them on the right side of the hall. They'll walk with students as they exit their designated location. Masks are mandatory and will be worn until students are inside vehicles and bus riders will continue to wear masks until they are released from the bus. For more information on Biloxi Schools Back to School Plan, visit BiloxiSchools.net and click on the Back to School Plan logo. We hope this information has helped you understand that a traditional opening may not be normal, but with everyone's help and cooperation, we can create a safe and successful school year.